A strange series of violent events unfolded today after a bicyclist was killed in a hit and run crash. The victim was run over on Ball Road, just west of the 5 freeway, and soon after, a chase and gunfire erupted. KCAL 9's Adriana Weingold has more from the crash site with the emotional reaction. Just a tragic situation out here. A man on his way home from work is hit and killed by an out of control driver. Now his widow is asking for justice. <laughs> A woman in tears as she left flowers and a candle at the spot where her husband died. She says her husband, 52 year old Encarnacion Salazar Munoz, was a hard working man, doing everything he could to provide for his family. He was riding his bike home from work early in the morning when he was hit and killed. To come and see his wife, heard in the morning, but he never got home. He never made it, man. It was just really bad, bad, man. The CHP says the driver is 25 year old Jason Roy Rocha. After hitting Munoz, authorities say he led police on a short chase that ended in Seal Beach with gunfire. Police say Rocha motioned that he had a handgun. That's when they opened fire but didn't hit Rocha. Back in Anaheim, the Munoz family is left in mourning. I mean, I mean he was just a good person, and he was just uh, dedicated to, to family, family members, just family. And um, he was just coming from work. Getting home, and um, we found out that this tra tragedy happened here. Munoz's family says he has three sons. They're all beside themselves after learning of their father's tragic death, and now they want justice. Rocha was booked on felony hit and run and suspicion of a DUI. In Anaheim, Adriana Weingold, KCAL 9 News.